One of the biggest questions in, from a physicist's perspective is why the universe began in a such a highly ordered state. Many, many physicists say this is the biggest question in physics because you know, the universe is, tends to disorder. That's the way it works. Everything gets more and more disordered. But so the Big Bang was a uniquely highly ordered, bizarrely, very strangely highly ordered thing. I was talking to, actually, we filmed some of this for the universe. This is why the universe could have, you know, it could have gone in many directions. And one of the things I really wish we'd done was um, I was talking to a philosopher of science um, about um, the probability. You know, you often hear the big the people say the Big Bang is a quantum fluctuation. There you go. It just fluctuated and it, didn't, it came into existence in this highly ordered state. It's been getting more disordered ever since. Fine, right? But um, disorder, the measure of disorder is a measure of the probability that you will spontaneously create it. So if you're very ordered, it's very unlikely you'll create it. If you're less ordered, it gets more and more and more likely you'll do it. And that's why things get more disordered. So the universe today is less ordered than it was then. So it's far more likely that it would fluctuate into existence now than it was that, that it would fluctuate into existence then. Because it's less ordered now, so it's more likely. So, so, it's, so a bit, it's a bit like you're throwing a pack of cards on the floor and collecting them. Yeah. They're much more likely to be shuffled than completely. Yes. So you get the shuffled universe rather than the ordered universe. So that means that it's more likely that we didn't exist there. Now we came into existence. That's more like the whole universe with us in it, having this conversation and everything we can see, it's more likely that would fluctuate into existence than it is that the Big Bang fluctuated into existence. And, and it's clear, the true, because it was very highly ordered then and it's less ordered now. So, so you, you, you're faced with this massive problem that if you want to say it's a quantum fluctuation, the, it's overwhelmingly more likely, and I mean ridiculously, billions and billions and trillions of times more likely that it would have fluctuated. Drinking game, now. the trillions. So that's, what, that's a, it's a huge problem. You can't dismiss it like that. You can't just say, oh, it was a fluctuation. It cannot be because it's more likely the universe fluctuated into existence now. So it's fascinating. It's, so it's a, a huge yeah, unanswered it's, question. Yeah, it's, it's, it's obvious when you know. think about it, especially yeah. in a bit of physics. It's just obvious, but I've never heard it said to me before.